welcome back to my channel Rosie Home. So I have a festive Poundland haul for you today. This completely was not intentional. I fell into Poundland and ended up coming out with three bags full. They had so much good stuff. Loads of really nice Christmas decorations that were really affordable and Christmas gift ideas, gift wrap. A few gifts I've got, um, lots of lovely stuff. And obviously the usual cleaning products. I've also got a little side table that I just couldn't leave the shop without. So there is lots of exciting stuff to show you. If you are new to my channel, then please do subscribe. I have a lot more festive and Christmas hauls and videos coming your way. I have a Home Bargains Christmas haul, a Primark Christmas haul. I also am planning to do lots of gift guides here. There's gonna be a men's gift guide, a ladies gift guide, a kids gift guide and a stocking filler gift guide. So if you don't want to miss those, subscribe to my channel, click the little notification bell now, and then you won't miss a video. Keep watching this video to find out what I picked up in Poundland for the festive season. So let's get started. First thing I'm gonna show you is this side table because I was really pleased with it. I actually left it in the store the first time I saw it and then I had to go back because I kept thinking about it. But I have this wooden side table with hairpin legs. These are really on trend at the moment. They're everywhere on Instagram. So they've got these cool legs and it's just like a little tabletop. I imagine it's quite a good size because the box is quite big. So I'm excited to see what that looks like. I'll include a little snippet of what it looks like when I've built it. I wonder if, Nick, will you build this now? No, not that. No, you won't go now. But anyway, this was only £10, which I think is such a good price. I think that'll look really nice. We're currently redoing our living room. I'm sat in the living room now, but we've got a chair to go in the corner over there by the window. And I think this little side table will look really nice next to it. I also want to put the candles on it, which I've got in this hall. I'm not gonna do this in any particular order. I'm just gonna pull stuff out of the bag. So the next one is gift wrap. I got these two really large craft paper bags. They were a pound each, but I don't think that's too bad um, for the size of them. I've got these for my friend's gifts um, to pop in there so that I can put all their little gifts and bits and pieces in there together. I've got two of those. I wanted to get some things for the girls' Christmas. Well, it's not a Christmas Eve basket. It's an advent basket. Um, on the first, when the elf comes, he normally brings a basket full of Christmas goodies. So I wanted to get some things to go in that. And I got them each a craft. So Rosie's got this uh, sewing kit to sew a hand puppet. Um, this is a little foil sticker craft where you make a little winter scene. I thought that'd be good for me. And then this one is a little mosaic pom-pom, which I'm hoping Ada will be able to do. I thought that was quite easy. Um, just stick the little pom-poms on Santa's beard. But yeah, I got them each a little craft activity. These were a pound each. Got some bleach. Actually got three of these because we have, actually we've got four toilets in this house. I seem to need some in every toilet. Also, I picked up some flash bathroom. Again, I just seem to be really low on cleaning products at the moment. I got some Christmas scented spray. This is Sugar Plum Delight. I've got another one as well, but that must be in a different bag. These were a pound, so I'm excited to see what this smells like. This is limited edition and just for the Christmas period. So it's Sugar Plum Delight. Here's the other bleach. All the stuff in this bag is covered in glitter. <laughs> From these two little trees, I picked up a gold one and a white one. Just these brush Christmas trees, because I thought they were cute. These were, I think they were a pound each, so I got two of them. I got three. I found another one. I got some elf marshmallows to go in the elf Christmas basket. Elf on the shelf, Christmas edition. And these are vanilla flavour mallows. They've got little Christmas trees and little snowflakes. I just thought they were really cute and a nice touch to go in their basket. I got these beautiful candles, which I think will look so nice on my little side table. I've actually got a bigger white one as well. So there'll be a little trio of Christmas tree candles. I just think they are so cute. I don't think I'm ever gonna like them because I just love the look of them, but I'm excited to see what they look like on my little table. These were a pound each, I think, and the bigger one was like three pound. The next thing I picked up were these little bath toys. Bath toys always get a bit gross, so I always like to buy some to replace the ones we have. These are little farmyard animals. Ada is just learning her animals, so I thought this would be something fun that we could practice in the bath with her to help her learning. So you've got a cow, a horse, a pig, a sheep, a chicken, and a duck. Um, she knows pretty much all those noises as well, so we'll be able to have some fun practicing with those in the bath. 
I got some bin bags because I needed some. I got these two pack of Merry Christmas gift boxes. I've actually opened these already. They were a little two pack, so there were two little boxes in here for one pound, which I think is such good value. And the reason why I've opened them is because I've been gift wrapping orders this morning and these fit a little FM Pure Perfume perfectly. So I've been using these for my gift wrap. I just think they look so nice and what a nice way to gift a perfume or a little treat to your loved ones. So I'm actually gonna tie this up with this string. And yeah, I just think that was a lovely touch and a really nice way to wrap your perfumes or little gifts for your family and friends. As I said, they were only 50 piece. That was a pound for two boxes. The next item I absolutely love, I think it's so pretty. I think I'm gonna put this on my TV stand. I was gonna put it on my windowsill, but I want my tree, which is where it was sitting at the moment. But I want my tree to go there in the middle. So I might move this to my TV stand because it is so pretty. I want everyone to see it. This was five pound from Patternland, but it is so cute. I really love the snowy, rustic vibe and I think it will look really nice in my living room even with the theme I'm going for in here this year. Next, I got some drawing pins. These are to put up Christmas decorations. We are in a freshly decorated living room at the moment and I'm unsure. Normally I like to hang things from the ceiling and I'm unsure whether I want to do that this year because it's just been painted, but we shall see. I bought drawing pins in case I do have the urge. I bought this diary. I thought this was a great gift for someone. I think it was two pound. It's a week to view um, diary. It has this zip all the way around and um, it's got a little ruler in there, little stickers, a pen, everything you need and little like dividers for each day. I just thought it was really lovely and a really nice gift to give someone. You can, there's like a to-do list section, goals, appointments, don't forget. I just thought it was really nice. I'm actually going to gift this to one of my family members because I think it's really nice. It's got little pockets to put bits and pieces in. It's just like a file of facts, really. It's got everything you need in there. And yeah, for a couple of pounds from Poundland, it was a bargain. I also got this desk calendar. This is actually for my husband to go on his desk. Um, it's a flip one. It was this sort of greeny color, light green. I thought this would be a good thing to go in his stocking if it fits, <laughs> if not in his sack. I got some candy canes, these were a pound. I picked up two of them, actually started gift wrapping with these ones already. But yeah, just a pound for candy canes, you can't go wrong. These ones are actually a pinky color. So if you were going with a certain theme for something um, and wanted more of a pinky tone, these ones would be good. So for my tree this year, I wanna keep it really simple with like wood and white accessories. I saw these Christmas fir cones and I thought they were so cute. I think these were two pound for six. I thought that was such a good price. They've got these little wooden beads on the top as well. I just thought they were really lovely and they'd be a nice addition to my tree. I also picked up these cute little snowy polar bears. I thought these would again go nicely on the all white tree. I got these little fur baubles. I've actually lost the thing for this one, so that's not so good. But I think these were one pound fifty. Um, but how nice are they? I got these big fur baubles and like the matching fur stars. These were a pound, I believe. And I just thought they would go really nicely on the white tree. These are slightly more silvery, but I just loved the beaded detail at the top of the bauble with like the um, brown bead and then the three white beads. I thought they were really lovely. Let me get one out for you. So I really like this detail at the top. I thought that was a nice touch. And again, I thought that would be quite nice on an all white tree. I also grabbed some baubles for the girls tree. They have these big <laughs> multicolored glittery baubles. Um, I got these white and pink baubles. I think these were all a pound. And then this pack of 15 mini baubles. I thought they were sweet and look, would look really nice on their pink tree. I'm also doing the girls an advent calendar this year. So I am filling all the pockets with treats myself. So I bought these little elf chocolates to go in there on some of the days. I also got a couple more packs of bath toys because these were only a pound and I have two babies in my family. So I thought they would like them too, as well as Ada. I got some dishmatics, all the essentials. Here is the beautiful white Christmas tree candle. So this is the large size, this is three pound. And I think these two are one pound 50, but I just thought those stacked together would look really nice. 
what do you think i got some shower cleaner a pound i got some of the bathroom anti-back cleaner also a pound and also the flash kitchen spray in the apple spice scent for christmas time so that is it that is the end of my poundland haul that's everything i picked up in poundland so i've got lots of gift ideas lots of christmas decorations i'm excited to put them up on my tree which should be happening next week we shall see i hope you enjoyed this video and you enjoyed seeing all the bits that i picked up as i said there are lots more christmas hauls coming your way so do subscribe and do click the little bell so you get notifications every time i post my schedule is going to be a little bit um all over the place at the moment because i've got lots of extra videos to post so so do subscribe and check the bell so you don't miss one Thanks so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.